at what point did you start uh, learning Bash, Python? What's the first one that, that you started with and when exactly in, in the process? Sure, so I started with, with Bash and I started um, probably like three weeks before I started the OSCP, I just started picking up some of that. So I was already working in as a network engineer uh, just started picking up some of that process and then I also uh, reviewed some Python and just kind of got into that like just somewhat comfortable understanding of the basics uh, and what I do I'm by no means a developer I am terrible at coding um, I will write out the logic behind it and I think that's what's important is to understand what's going on in the in the language and how you want to think logically about it so I'll say okay well I want my program to do uh, these five things and then you you can build upon that later if you start thinking about logical flaws or something that might might break your program or how a user might input something incorrectly or you know uh, all these situations that might come up but from a baseline I want my I want my program to do this and I'll write that out and what it might look like and then I'll just go to Google and I'll say look I know I'm looking for something along these lines y you know there's got to be something out there on Stack Exchange or somebody who's already written part of this code yeah. yeah Stack Overflow and uh, you copy that you make it your own and then you just keep improving upon it um so i am definitely what i call a google developer well i'll take bits and pieces of code and just put them together uh it'll be awful at first and then you you fine tune it or maybe you sit down with somebody else who's also a coder and you say like can you look at my script just give it a review and tell me how you might improve it uh and then they'll they'll give you some feedback you go back to the drawing table and and, and fix it as well so you you actually learn on the go and you improve like in time so you don't necessarily Absolutely. have to learn the entire syntax of python if you just need a little bit of code that would actually get you through your process right yeah you learn all these little tricks over time and like the important especially if you're just getting into cybersecurity or just getting into like pen testing is understanding the basics like what's a conditional statement what is a variable you know, what is, what is, what are loops? Like understanding that will just help you out so much. Even understanding like a, a one line a for loop for a bash is so useful in a lot of situations. So uh, you don't have to be this developer or this coder to be successful, especially at a beginner level. If you want to gain an edge over other cybersecurity professionals, take my Python for pen testers course and uh, learn how to leverage the power of Python in penetration testing and cybersecurity. Link in the description.